Hey everybody, welcome back. <clears throat> we are returning to the darkest of dungeons. Um, I ate just before we started again, so I'm going to be clearing my throat regularly probably. Of course, today I've, I don't know, I, I, I know you, I know it's fascinating to hear about my, uh, my physiological idiosyncrasies, but uh, today I've had a lot of drainage in general, so I don't think there was any way around it. Anyway. <clears throat> ah. God, I'm sick of doing that. Anyway, 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 anyway. <laughs> we are back. Last time, I believe we took the antiquarian out for a spin. She did all right. I mean, it was okay. I wasn't particularly thrilled or anything. Um, I think we already recruited whoever we needed. I can't remember. Uh, but why don't we go out and see what missions await us. Okay, we don't have any bosses, so we need to make some progress here. <clears throat> We've already fought the bosses in the ruins, the warrens, and the weald, so conventional wisdom seems to suggest that we should go to the cove. And I want to take a party of level ones here, so why don't we take Sir Judicale? We'll take Wisp. Um, let's take Vitalis. Then we need a healer, don't we? So, hmm. Can I put... Let's see, what does Wisp have? Alright, everything but poison darts Wisp can use from the second position. So, I think I might put Wisp in position number two here. Because we really do probably need a healer. Although, do you have the healing skill? No. You don't have the mark skill either, that sucks. Um... Hang on. What is your disease? Vampiric spirits. Okay, the vampiric spirits is not too bad. But I'm gonna go here, and we're gonna buy Battlefield Bandage. Oh, you do have Sniper's Mark. I just didn't have it equipped. Okay. Yeah. I like this configuration a lot better, I think. So this is what... Alright, this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna do something a little weird here, okay? We're gonna get weird. <coughs> Sir Judicale, Wisp, Vitalis. Spot number three is gonna go to Wiggles, maybe? No, actually, hang on. Ah, this is frustrating. Okay. Yes, we will send Wiggles in party spot number three. And then we're actually gonna go take Wisp over here and have Wisp learn Pick to the Face. <clears throat> and while we're at it, why don't we give Wisp some upgrades here? Uh, okay, game froze for a minute. That was less than ideal. Um, Can I upgrade their weapons? Is that going to be overly expensive? Ah! Okay, the game's kind of hiccuping on me here. I'm not a huge fan of that. I don't know if that's going to show up in recording or not, but... Yeah, see, it just did it again. Uh, this is going to get annoying if it keeps doing it. Oh, well. All right. Looks like we can afford without going... Uh, now we're below 10k. So... <clears throat> Looks like we can afford it, though. We can afford to upgrade everybody. Uh, I think I actually can go a little below 10k, honestly. So why don't we do that? Um, harvest is going to be useless, so we're not going to bother. Uh, sniper shot. Bandage. I think those are the only two I really need to worry about with you. And Judicale is already pretty heavily upgraded, so we don't need to worry about him either. Uh, does he have everything he needs? He does not have Stunning Blow. I don't like that. Okay. So let's go... Oh, he does have Stunning Blow. I just don't have it equipped. What is with the lack of equipping? Okay, there. He's good. All right. So, yeah, this is going to be the group we're going to take. <coughs> uh, now, I think I'm actually going to go ahead and uh, see if I can figure out this uh, issue I'm having with the game hiccuping on me here. So, I'll be right back. I'm going to put in a cut here, and then uh, I'll jump back in. So, see you guys in a little bit here. Okay. We are back. Sorry about that, guys. I just wanted to make sure I could get the game running properly. So far, so good. 
we'll see if it keeps giving me the issue. If it does, we'll probably just keep going, especially since I'm going to be in a mission after this. But, yeah. <clears throat> I just wanted to figure, see if I could figure out what was going on there, because it's a little weird. Anyway. That's weird. I already changed out all my party members. Why are they back like that? All right. I don't know why it did that, but it doesn't ultimately seem to be an issue because even though the party reconfiguration didn't go through, the party is still... Like, everything that I upgraded is still upgraded. So we're not in too bad a shape here. Everything's good. All right. So this is going to be our squad. We're going to do a medium exploration mission in the cove. Let's go. All right, cove. Cove, you want plenty of shovels. You want probably ten torches, enough for a feast, and one, two, three meals. You might be able to get away with less, but I'm going to take that just uh, as a point of order here. Bring some bandages. You want plenty of those. Maybe like um, three keys and an extra holy one. Okay, I think that's pretty good. You really don't need anti-venoms for anything in here. Or no, you do. You need it for one thing. So I will bring one anti-venom. And this is going to be our configuration here. So we've got an extra shovel. We got some extra torches. And we got plenty of food. So why don't we go ahead and rearrange our inventory here. Okay. Alright, that looks good. So, this is going to be our setup. We got about 3,000 gold left. Let's go. All right. So I do not have a I do not have a dedicated healer in this squad. I'm hoping that doesn't end up being a huge problem. If I need healing in a pinch, I do have my arbalist, and I got plenty of stress healing, so I will not have to worry about stress healing. That means camping should be able to be exclusively dedicated to healing hit points. So if I get in a real bad spot in terms of my hit points, I can just camp, ideally. The smell of rotting fish is almost unbearable. As I was saying, ideally, I will only have to do that sometime around the halfway point. Hmm. Do I want to go for this room here? Technically, I really don't need to, but yeah, let's 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 leave that for now. All right. So we got a box. Let's open the box. There's nothing in it. We got a trap. You disarm the trap. Fantastic. All right. We'll go in this room. There's nothing in it. We're going to use a torch. Got some scouting. Okay. No enemies yet. That's surprising and a little concerning because that probably means they're backloaded on the end of this. I would prefer to have them a little more spread out if possible. Okay. We got a barnacle encrusted chest. We're going to use a shovel. Knock those barnacles off. Get a gold, some loot. Trinkets and baubles. Paid for in blood. Looty loot 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 loot. No scouting this time. Okay. Um Let's see. 90%. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I'm not good enough at ma at head math to figure out what 90% of 14 is, so. We're going to go explore this side. See what we can find. Hunger check. Wonderful. And another barnacle chest. Okay, we're going to use one more here. Because I want to make sure I have at least if three. If only treasure could staunch the flow of otherworldly corruption. I want to make sure I have at least three. In case we run into several blockages and we get unlucky with those. Stress wave, okay. Do stress damage to me all day. I am perfectly okay with that. We're gonna battle ballad. Get everybody's crit and speed up. Um. Okay, stress damage is not a big problem. We need to kill the grouper. He is priority one here. Why don't we go ahead and stun this guy if we can. Okay, good. Uh, spear fishing. Miss! Ha <laughs> ha! Fantastic! Okay. Uh, 5 to 11, pretty good chance. Continue Just enough. Onslaught. Fantastic. Alright. Destroy them all. Alright, he's gonna spit on us. Yeah. We got debuffed. Debuff is bad. Wow! 
You are just Johnny on the spot with those dodge. You know what I just realized? We don't have any trinkets equipped. <laughs> God damn it. I forget something every time. I need to go back to playing this regularly. Like, just, just to keep the quality of play up. I need to go back to playing this regularly so I don't forget these things. <laughs> Whatever. I'm blaming it on the fact that I had to, like, restart the game and I was worried about the quality. I wasn't thinking about how to actually be prepared, so... Sorry. I imagine we'll still do okay. Knock on wood. Just keep on battle balloting. Uh, let's see. Why don't we mark this guy, set him up for a kill? Of course. You're a bastard. But I can fix this. Yeah, there we go. Not protecting him now. Ah! Scurvy now? God damn. Ooh, yeah. I like it. Um, is anyone particularly bad on stress? No. So, it's really... Really not much to do here, but battle battle. Make sure we have the initiative advantage here. Three damage. Wonderful. Alright, this guy needs to be marked. He's going to take a lot of damage to bring down with that protection up where it is, so. <clears throat> okay, good dodge. Um, I really would not have much chance of bleeding him, so I don't think it's worth it. Let's just buff everybody again. And start doing damage to this guy. Wow, guys. Yeah. That'll get us a kill. <clears throat> Alright. Nice resist. I like it. Um, just keep doing it. While... Why bother doing anything else? Ah, dang it. I forgot to equip pick to the face. Ah, alright. Just stop. It gets something done at least. Two damage. Great. Blind fire. Press this nice. advantage. Give them no quarter. What's her speed at? Plus ten. Foolish horrors. Brought low and driven into the mud. Okay. So first off, you're gonna move up here. And we're gonna unequip that. Equip that. Okay. Scouting! What do we got? Secret rooms. Ooh, a critical scouting success will sometime reveal a secret room. This must be the first one I found on this file. Advance to the tile marked with a star and press W or click to enter. Fabulous wealth and riches await those equipped with a key. Well, fortunately, I brought three. So I can definitely use a key on the treasure in this room down here. Ah, crap. That's right. Inventory space. It's important. All right, we're going to trade out the gold. Although busts are probably the lowest priority, just because the only thing you really need them for is the chapel and the sanitarium. Deeds, crests, and uh, the other thing. Is there th is there another thing? Portraits. Uh, deeds, crests, and portraits are a little more important, in my opinion. Okay, you hit the pelagic grouper. Uh, yep, we're getting a stress wave. Okay, that's not too bad. We have plenty of stuff to deal with that. Um, we're gonna battle battle in here. I wanna get our speed up so we can outrun this thing because I'm gonna be a little risky here and try to kill the pelagic grouper first. Oh, wow, that's a lot of damage. All right. Ah, shit. Okay, you hit him Destroyed. and one shot, fantastic. A little more brine coming in. That's a dodge. Fantastic. All right, just finish him. Nice. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Um, dip, 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 dip. about a fifty percent chance to bleed, and you would do some damage. But I like the stress heal here. 
which has just been undone. Thank you. You jerk. We're gonna do some healing. Because we need to start healing early because we don't have a whole lot in the way of healing, so. Another yeah! abomination. Nice job, Judy That's how we do it. That's how we do it. Okay. Um, well, let's stress heal again. Watch, he's gonna do it again. He is, you son of a bitch! Well, I dodged it, so screw you. Die. Hmm. Alright, you can go ahead and do another heal. Keep that heal buff going up. And it doesn't really matter, so let's just cleave. Who cares? A trifling victory. Mm. But a victory nonetheless. Arr. I'm not a fan of this. Mm. Alright, so I'm gonna have to drop some stuff here. And I think I might have to go over here and then come back for the secret room because I, I there's no way I'm going to be able to take all the stuff in that room unless I get a ton of trinkets or something which I might now that I think about it I might get pretty much all trinkets but I don't want to risk that I'm not going to so I'm not going to take the chance use a key packs laden with loot right. are often low on supplies um, do I have anything low value? Yeah, let's replace the citrines. Because this max value is 1,500, this max value is 1,000. So we'll just replace that. Okay, back through the tunnels. More hunger. That frees up an inventory space right there. I think I might just go with a normal meal instead of a feast, because I'm a little worried about all these hunger checks. We're getting kind of unlucky with him, to be honest. Alright. So, probably camp somewhere in these three rooms right here. We're gonna go past the secret room. We're gonna use another torch. Okay, we probably need to not use any more torches. Portrait. I'll take it. Ooh. That's an interesting group. We surprised them, so that's good. Go hard on the stingers. Why don't you do a blind fire? I need damage on everything. Their formation All right. is broken. Fantastic. Maintain and he's bleeding. Go ahead and kill him. And he's gonna hit Wisp. Wisp seems to be a popular target. There seems to be a lot of attacks coming in on face fight over oh i don't want to leave those behind remind yourself that overconfidence oh is i don't want to leave those behind and insidious um, killer crap what are we going to toss you know what let's get rid of the portrait I would much rather, like, deeds are my high-value item right now, so I'm going to leave, leave the portrait behind and the onyx behind. All right. Let's continue on our way, and we need to camp here pretty soon. So... I think we'll probably camp up here, to be honest. Okay. This is going to be interesting. Battle Ballad. Okay, we're gonna go for the grouper. Nice. Although technically I should have had her hit him. Because now the Arbalist isn't gonna have much to do. Or although a job opportunity just opened up when you took ten damage or whatever the hell. Seven damage, okay. That's not too bad. She's gonna get debuffed all the time because she's got vampiric spirits, so there's nothing I can really do about that. Um, you know what? Why don't you try and bleed this thing? There we go. Now we won't have to worry about it. Ah, damn. Okay. Can you give me a clutch blind fire here? Nope. But at least that thing's dead this turn. Ow, good god. You hurt so much. Okay. So what we're gonna do here, we're gonna do a little bit of healing. It's not much. Slowly. 
gently. And we're gonna hope he doesn't this go again. This is how a life is taken. Wonderful. And more onyx. As victories mount, so too will resistance. Crap. Okay. It's fairly unlikely that I'm going to find anything that the holy water needs, so I'm going to get rid of the holy water. Uh, in fact, I'm not going to get rid of it. Just have you two use it. We're going to open this up. We're going to get some more crests that we can't carry. Okay, we are definitely camping in this next room. Please don't be a fight. Please don't be a fight. It's a fight. But we surprised him. That's a plus. Okay. Well, I think these two are the priority. So flashing daggers is a good choice here. And we'll do that to finish the thrall off. And why don't you... I don't want to risk death's door here. So why don't you heal with this extra turn we've got? And then you clean to take out the group. Stress, I can handle. Stress, you, you stress me out all day if you want to. Yeah, that does not surprise me. Okay, Call of the Deep, that's not great. He is basically a juggernaut right now. Gonna do some more healing. Hmm. Just take this opportunity to do a stress heal. Alright. And... Why don't you go for the stun? I like the stun. Here. And then... I guess you're gonna hit him, because you can't really do much else. Okay. Alright. Hit him for eight. That's good. There goes all that work. Three to four. Decent chance. Let's take it. Ah, crap. And it didn't bleed him either. Come on. All right. Keep healing. Let's just slowly build that health up there. I'm not too worried about what this guy can do to us. Hmm. Okay. Just hit him again, I guess. Uh, what else are we really gonna do? Come on. Let me go first. Okay, he's been dealt with. I'm gonna move Wiggles back. Vitalis, go ahead and heal. Okay. Uh, let's get a stun in. buff worn off. And then I guess you guys just go ham. Stress healing. Nice. Okay, you're not bleeding anymore. Aw, oh, man. What do I do here? I think I take the kill. The healing probably would be cancelled out by whatever damage he did to us, so... Be wary. Triumphant pride precipitates okay. a dizzying fall. We are definitely camping here. A spark without kindling is a goal without hope. And we're just gonna do a normal meal. Okay. We really don't have any problems right now, so... I think this is a good opportunity to do whatever attack buffs we can do. So, why don't we do Tiger's Eye on uh, that person. Wisp, the Grave Wobber. The Grave, the Grave Wobber. Oh my god, it's the Grave Wobble. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Um... That's the only thing I have that prevents nighttime ambush, isn't it? Yeah. I don't have very good skills for when I'm not dealing with any problems. Uh, well, I guess what we could do is... Uh, we could do this. 
Your whining bothers me. Just smile. We can do this. And we can do this. Get everybody topped off. And we're good. Plenty of blood left to shed this day. I've seen nothing I'm not prepared for. Can anyone carry a tune? I would assume the jester As can. As the light gains purchase, well, the guitar. spirits are lifted and purpose is made clear. Uh, I'm trying to remember what this does. I think it's a damage buff. So why don't we have you take it? It is not a damage buff. It reduces your stress. Alternatively. So, that's the other thing it does. Okay, before we go using any torchlight, let's go down this way, back to the secret room. I might throw away my last key here just to get some more inventory space if I need it. We'll find out. I may not end up needing it because I might get nothing but trinkets from in here. Um, I think you have a pretty good chance of doing that the first time you find one of these. Let's find out. Wealth yep. beyond Two measure. Trinkets. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Okay, let's do this. For now, we're just going to equip both of these on you. And we're going to take that. And then what we're going to do from there is we're going to... Ah, uh, I need an inventory space. Ah, this is super bad. Um, I don't suppose I can... No. Damn! That sucks. Well, I guess until I get an inventory space... Uh-oh. Until I get an inventory space, you're holding both. Which is somewhat less than ideal. Oh, God. That's kind of scary. All right. This is going to hurt, isn't it? Okay, we just need to fucking go super ham on one of these guys. Ooh, Jesus. Okay, that's that's an ideal target if ever there was one right there. Um, we need to kill kill one of them. And you kill another one. Nice. Dismiss head doing work. Nine damage. And just go for the third stab and finish him. There we go. Not so bad. Not not as bad as it looked like it was initially. Can be felled. They can be beaten. We handled that pretty well, I think. Uh, we're gonna throw away our last key, and I guess we're not taking that. So, oh well. All right. Let's go this way up here. Let's go down this path. Oh, hey, I have an inventory space now. No, I don't. Never mind. Damn it. I should have done that first. Okay. Oh, my God, these crates. These crates are garbage. Nope. Not touching that. Bye. You are bad every time. Well, not every time, but most times. All right. Well, I might get some... Inventory space from hunger checks, but that's certainly not ideal. <sighs> Finding the stuff is only the first test. Now it must be carried home. Switch. We got a madman. Ouch. I'm cool with that. You, you keep right on keeping on there, buddy. Ouch. Hmm, that's not so good. Okay. All right, high damage targets are the first priority here. I'm not actually too worried about the madman. What we really need to kill is the the brawler and the grouper. So let's see if we can get some damage on the madman. Still. Yeah, there we go. That'll work. That won't. Damn it. Decimated. Got the brawler in one shot. I'm okay with that. I'm not okay with that in the least. Damn it. 
this some bitch. All right. Well, I guess that means we don't really have a whole lot of options. So let's stun this guy. Get the protection buff off. Okay. He's just afflicting everyone with the plus 10 stress, dam stress damage until camp. I'm not a huge fan of that. And he dodged that, which the whole reason I was doing it was to hit him. Madman, you're causing me some trouble right now, buddy. Yeah. Uh, we need the kill, but we need healing, too. I think we're going to have to take the healing. And just hope uh, that she'll go first. Okay, there's not even any point to attacking this guy. We're not going to do any damage. So let's get the corpse out of the way and move everybody up. That way I can now reach the madman with my crusader. Oh boy. Getting a little worried about the ah! assault cannot be left unanswered. God damn it. All the heals right now on the grave robber. Save Wisp's life. Fuck your bro. ass, bitch. You gonna pull that shit on me? I don't think so. Die. <laughs> Bleed some more. You're dead. Octocestus. Perfect. Oh Grievous my god! Injury. I was gonna say it was fine, but it's not fine. It's beyond fine. Okay. Why don't you switch places? The slow death. Okay, he's gone. Unforeseen. Unforgiven. Uh, 25 is probably the worst. So let's do 25. All right, now you need to just keep healing the grave robber until we get her out of the danger zone here. Oh my God, okay, thank you. Um, all right, we need to do damage to this guy before we start getting warnings about uh, getting screwed over. So let's just hit him twice. He's in pretty bad shape. We can probably kill him within a, within a round of attacks next turn. So, go ahead and do some healing, stress and health-wise. And you go ahead and do some stress healing. It gets everybody in a pretty good place, stress-wise. And that ought to top the Grave Robber off, just about. I was going to get a little salty if he hit that. A singular yeah. strike. Suck it. Really sucks that's a man at arms only trinket, man. It's not that great though, honestly. Alright, let's get rid of the bandages. They're not really doing anything for us right now. Okay. What else we got? Empty room. Empty room. That's, that's how I like it. Okay, at most, there would be three blockages. So I think it's safe to use a shovel right here. We get some more of those. A warrior's bracer. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I think I like it more than the sly eye patch, honestly. Plus, I can do this. Bam. Bam. And while we're at it, bam. Nice. And therein lies the advantage of not taking trinkets. <laughs> Extra inventory space. How many torches we got left? Two? Okay. That's probably enough to explore at least these rooms here. Mm, another crate. What do we got? A fortune waiting to be spent. Stuff we can't carry. Well... Crap. 
I, I think I have enough crests at this point. I have 24 of them, so I'm gonna leave those behind. Disarm the trap. We're gonna use another torch. Go on in here. Mission complete. Wonderful. We're gonna continue exploring, though. Because we're still in decent shape. And we got an extra torch, so that helps us even more. A handsome reward for a task well performed. Why don't we go ahead and use this torch here? Go in full light for this last room, which has nothing in it. Okay. Let's go ahead and explore the rest of this floor. The rest of this floor. The rest of this dungeon. And use up what's left of our curios, because we're really not in bad shape. I don't feel like we're going to have any trouble with anything we run into. Bandits, that's not that's not too bad. We can deal with bandits, especially because our jester can actually be used to attack things when we're fighting bandits. Without being completely worthless, because our bleeds don't work. That's not great, but fortunately I have uh, that shadow step thing, shadow fade. So I can do this. Um, I guess that's right. And fix my party order again. Blanket fire. All right, those guys need to die quick. They're gonna cause me all sorts of problems. Okay, finish him off, nice. Oh, why couldn't that be on the other one? Damn it. And I was thinking about targeting him too, but I was like, go for, these, go for the certain kill. Shows what I know. Okay, why don't we do some healing here? He can get a bleed on the gun guy to shut him down. He's stunned, so we don't have, even have to worry about him this turn. That would only be one health. That's not really good. That corpse is going to bleed out. Damn it! Got to pay attention to these things. All right. Precision. And That's power. good. He's dead. Wondrous. Um, that's a hundred percent stun chance. In all likelihood, he's going to resist it. So, why don't you just kill this guy? Because I want to get uh, Judicale's health back up here. How quickly the tide turns. That's what I get for trying to stall. Go well to hell, struck. you bastard. Okay. Seize this Portrait. momentum. Push on to the task's end. You know, I really don't care much for that, but at the same time, it's only one portrait. I have no guarantee I'm going to get any more than that, so... I'm just going to keep going. Let's open up the map. So I can see it when they put enemies in my path like that. Nothing this time around. Now we do have... There's our limiting factor right there. The hunger check. We can probably absorb one starvation. If we get a starvation, we can go... Like, we gotta go. But I feel confident in going this way and eating one starvation. Now, I don't want to do that, but it's something I think we might be able to get a... Gnawing hunger sets in, turning the body against itself, weakening the mind. Okay. I'm pretty close. I just want to get in here and see if I can just explore this. Oh, I don't have it scouted, though. You know what? Let's just go. It's not worth the risk. Despite its morbid aspect, this twisted cavernous maze seems almost traversable. Fortunately, we did really great on stress in there, so the hunger stress is not going to make things too bad for us. I would still probably be pretty comfortable taking this same group out again and just having the Jester get everybody's stress off. But uh, less than ideal. I was hoping I could get a little bit more out of that, but I suppose I did get about 10,000. You know, that's pretty good. Uh, more than if you count that, but I always, I always kind of count that as just given. 
I'm always kind of more concerned with how much I've collected. Uh, we didn't get a whole lot in the way of heirlooms besides crests, but we got a ton of crests. Uh, Wisp is now level 2. And is light sensitive? Bad. And has armor tinker, which is okay. Night blindness? That's pretty much a non-issue. What time is it? Okay. I see something long absent in the sunken faces of passers-by. A glimmer of hope. Now, what did we need to recruit? Because I think we're in good shape right now to go get ourselves some recruits. Uh, let's unequip all and sort. Fantastic. So yeah, those are th that's a pretty big pickup there, those two items right there. That's, that's pretty solid. The stress damage can be bad, but the, the benefits that you get from those generally outweigh the stress, the stress problems. Okay. So let's see here. We've got... I thought those were at level two. All right, so the Stagecoach Network, I really only need one more upgrade there for the 25 deeds. And then I'll have plenty of heroes, but really I don't I don't really need that right now because I've got I've got four each time and I think that's more than enough. Now what did we need at this at this lower level here? Uh, Sir Judicale and Facon are tanks. Rue, Hoto, and Asmodeus and Pistris are our healers. So we're pretty we're doing pretty well on that. So I don't really think we need to recruit anybody. Therefore, I think it's probably in our best interests to go get some of these diseases treated because Vitalis over here has scurvy and basically she has no resistances to anything. She's just gonna get screwed if, any, if anybody tries anything on her. All right, uh, what about over here? That reduces training costs and that's portraits anyway, so. Uh, deed stuff. Yeah, that's odd. Why won't it let me upgrade that? Weapon smithing and armor smithing are both level two. That doesn't make any sense. Or do they have to be this, like this level? Okay, that might be what it is. Um, let's see. Can I do some trading here? Here, let's do crests. I would need to get nine. So 27 crests would get me nine deeds. That, okay, that's been upgraded by one. How about over here? All right. So why don't we do this? We're going to do nine deeds. So that'll leave us at 35 crests. And then we're going to upgrade weaponsmithing. A sharper sword, a stronger shield. Anything to prolong a soldier's life. So now we need to get armor smithing. That's our next priority as far as deeds go. But that's going to do it for this particular time here. I don't really think there's anything else I'm going to do. Um, if there is, I will do it uh, for the next video. So thanks, everybody, for watching. Um, sorry it took so long for the next one to come out, but, you know, we already talked about that. Uh, I got a lot going on, so... I'll just put out videos as I can, and that's that's kind of the best I'm going to be able to do right now. So hopefully everybody's doing okay with that. Uh, hopefully everybody's doing okay in general. How you doing, guys? How you doing? You doing all right? Good. I'm glad to hear it. Anyway, thanks everybody for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you are not subscribed to the channel and you did enjoy the video, please go ahead and subscribe so you can see more stuff like this, see more XCOM 2, see more Earthbound if I ever get around to doing another episode of that. 
Uh, if you are subscribed, then please go ahead and like and or share this video. Uh, spreading the word is always very much appreciated. It would be super great if uh, I could get more eyes on this channel and liking and stuff like that also shows your support for the channel and shows me that people care about this stuff and want me to keep doing it. So that's greatly appreciated. All that being said, I'm going to call it a day and I'll see you guys next time.